Okay, that's uh, My Family by... Well, let me see, who is it by? Okay, The Bootman. Okay, let me just show you in my YouTube video. That's the CD I'm playing, soundtrack of The Bootman. And uh, Bootman, there's no the, but anyway. Um, yeah, uh, that was uh, My Family by Banana Oil. Okay, so as I said, uh, Bootman is actually an Aussie-American film, but... The soundtrack itself, they're all Aussies. They're all Aussie um, bands and artists uh, featuring UMI, Regurgitator, Paul Kelly, Green Spoon, Leonardo's Bride, Oblivia, The Living End, and more. Uh, and, of course, this banana oil. <laughs> um, okay, let's just read about this movie. And, by the way, I think I'm going to play these two CDs again next week because we don't have enough time to... Uh, listen to uh, more songs from these CDs and they're all great songs so I do want to listen to them again so next week I'm going to play these two songs again but let's just finish about all the information for these two CDs today okay the boot uh, no the just Bootman Bootman is a 2000 Australian American romantic comedy film directed by Dean Perry it was distributed by Fox Search Light Pictures and funded by Australian Film Finance Corporation Production was from 19... We don't need that. Well, it's in 1999, and it was produced in Sydney and Newcastle. Um, it stars Adam Garcia, Sophie Lee, and Sam Worthington. Um, the film was released in Australia in 2000, and it was a Dean Paris debut film. It wasn't bad. It was pretty good, actually. Um, okay, so previously, uh, Dean Perry was involved with stage shows such as The Tap Dogs and Steel City. Uh, it is also known as Tab Docs in Japan. Okay, so um, let's just go straight to uh, the songs. Okay, so in this soundtrack, we've, we've got, as I've already mentioned, the, the artists that we have. So it's got 20 songs, and apart from the ones I've already mentioned, we've got this uh, Custard, we've got Deborah Conway, and I'm not, is, is Deborah Conway really Aussie? So, I, oh, she is. Yeah, I just don't listen to her, so I guess that's why I don't know her. Yeah, and Death Star, and then, um, uh, Super, Super Scuba, or Super Scuba, I don't know how you read that, but anyway. Yeah, so, uh, that's all about Bootman, uh, and let's just go straight now to... The Walk Boy, okay, that's, you can see in the YouTube video, that's uh, the cover of the Walk Boy soundtrack. It's pretty much the cover of the movie as well. Uh, it's an Australian movie. That's fully Australian movie. Well, okay, what, wait, uh, Bootman talks about, I didn't read that, wait. Well, I think it talks about um, a tap dance group from Australia, okay, so it's pretty much like, like the tap docs themselves. I think it's based on the tap docs. Okay, that's Bootman, and close that one, let's read The Walk Boy now. It's a 2000 Australian comedy film directed by Alexi Vallis and starring Nick Giannopoulos, Vince Colosimo, Lucy Bell, Abby Tucker, Stephen Curry, Tony Nicolacopoulos, and Darren Hinch. I always have a problem in reading Greek surname, but yeah. Nick Giannopoulos is very famous, and that's why I know how to read that. Okay, so Steve... Um, uh, performed by Nick Ginopoulos is a first generation Greek Australian Steve is unemployed this is the plot by the way but manages to get by helping out here and there his pride and joy is his VF Valiant Pacer whilst, whilst helping out a compensation oriented neighbour Steve has a minor car accident involving the Minister of Employment uh, Vampley played by Geraldine Turner the net result of his encounter is twofold Steve gets to meet Celia Lucy Bell whom he is instantly attracted to, but who initially hates him. And Steve gets outed on national television by Darren Hinch as the worst adult bludger in Australia. Yeah, now I remember. I still got the CD, actually, the VCD in my house. Uh, but yeah, nobody watches the VCD anymore, so I still keep it just for memorabilia. Uh, Steve manages to turn this around to his advantage and becomes famous as the walk boy, spearheading a campaign to improve the employment status of the country. Entram, he makes uh, variable progress with Celia. It was really funny, actually. Okay. Um, yeah, so we've listened to a couple of songs uh, by Denny Hines, and the second one, Breaking There's No Stopping Us by Alanda and Joanne, and Shine uh, by Vanessa Ramarossi. And it's 
we've got a lot more to listen to. That's why we need to listen to this next week. But right now, let me just play you guys this song by Red Zone. As I said, uh, this is totally Aussie movie, but some of the singers are actually from the UK, like Red Zone is from the UK, uh, with a song called She's Got That Vibe. Obviously, it's an it's a, a, um, old song. Uh, performed again by the Red Zone. So this is the Red Zone with the song She's Got That Vibe. Still in Kumbang Channel. Kumbang, kumpul bareng yo. <laughs> 